So I kind of wanted to try a little bit of a new format of video and I got asked recently to make a patch for someone and I figured, you know, what a great place to try a new format is something, a process I know pretty well and this is the style of patch I make. This is a diaper bag I made out of old Dickies pants for my girlfriend and Nightmare Before Christmas patch I made and then uh, Zelda Game Boy bag that I made for her. I also have this little spawn emblem, spawn shield I made for a jacket for myself. I haven't really made anything for anybody else in quite some time. This is the uh, patch that I was asked to make. It's his logo. It's pretty cool. The material is think called twill. I don't really know. I bought it forever ago. I've been carrying around a lot of things. I print off some stencils and then I use this um, seam tape or like hemming tape to harden the back, make, you know, give a gluing layer and then put them together. On one moment. So, like I said, I use this seam or hemming tape to you know, provide a stiffer back and also to glue the layers together. Um, I had been using stitch witchery but it made it too thick. I don't know how to use little bitty bitty tiny tape but stitch witchery was too thick. Sorry if anybody's offended by my use of the iron. It's my iron and it's actually kind of a pain, a piece POS. Forgive me if I don't talk loud enough, I'm sorry. My camera doesn't have a very good microphone and I am sh not shy so much as nervous. Uh, this is new and I just... Kind of a fun process. I'm going to skip ahead now. So here's one completed piece of material. It's a little bit stiffer now. I've just taken them, put a couple of pins through it to, I guess I should probably pay attention. I hold the whole thing together though. Again, sorry if I'm <laughs> very quiet. I'm sorry, but just kind of pin the whole thing together. Give me, skip forward a little bit more. <laughs> Alrighty, I guess try to show this on the camera, but I just get yourself a nice pair of fiskers, nice sharp pair of scissors, and I prefer these things. I've almost cut my finger tip. Well, I mean, I have cut my fingertip off with them, but like I literally found the easiest way possible to make all this stuff and like cheat, cheat hardcore. It's kind of what I wanted to show with uh, what I do with the metalwork, but I'm going to skip forward again because I don't have much video.